Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit different, but pretty much the same. I will be stuffing in this video, and I will let you know what I'll be stuffing after my little Amazon haul. In this video today, I'm going to be showing you what I got for budgeting off of Amazon. I just wanted to add a few more tools just to make everything a little bit more fun and a little bit more lively. So if you love videos like this, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. All right, let's just get right into it. This is the Solit Cash Envelope Wallet. So I'm just gonna be opening it. So the first thing I noticed is this thank you card. Super cute in black and white. I love black and white. If you guys don't know that already, those are my two favorite colors. Oh, that is cute. I do like that. So the next thing I see is these cash envelopes. Also in my favorite color. This is the reason why I picked this wallet because it was one of the only ones on Amazon that had two basic colors. All the other black ones had floral envelopes and this and that. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna actually use these, but I will let you know if I do. And if I do, I'll probably write what I'm stuffing with the Cricut so it can fit right here, but I'm not sure yet. Like I said, I'll let you know. And they also come with some budgeting sheets. I'm actually gonna be using my budgeting sheets now. So I'm gonna start doing that. So wish me luck. <laughs> but these are super cute. So what I was thinking was fold this in or cut this little piece off, but it'll be fine. Cause then I can just stuff it sideways. And I actually like that way. I've actually seen another YouTuber that she stuffs her envelopes this way, like um, this way instead of this way so i can do that as well i think i'd rather do that because i would want to save these and make sure they last because i feel like if i don't laminate them they're probably not gonna last so you'll see that in an upcoming video if i do that i just wanted to put that back in the bag just so it doesn't get everywhere and last but not least the beautiful wallet it's a little bit um light i'm not gonna say cheap but it is light the zipper is light as well it's not rough um okay so it does have a little pocket maybe for your cell phone if it's small enough or some extra cash the zipper is super simple just a little hard leather tab. Let's open it up. Oh, she's pretty. So it has a pen holder, the A6 rings, small ones, not too bad. A little card holder here and here. And the Solite logo here. And then I'm just gonna open it up and there's a ton of pockets. 3, 6, 9, 12 card slots. I don't have that many cards. <laughs> we also have a little coin pooch there. This looks so good. I like that. Anyway, I just want everything to look cute. That took forever. Let's do something simple, which is this. It's a large mouse pad. Super basic. I'm gonna put it on my desk now. That looks perfect. That's the mat there. This is the next thing. This is the coin tray in black. I actually was inspired to get this coin tray from a new budgeter here on this wonderful budget community minimalist on a budget she really did inspire me to get this and when i noticed that there was a black one i just had to snag it and so pretty yeah. Yay. 
I first came to this budgeting community I didn't realize that the money holder everybody was using are actually you would never guess it's a sunglass holder so I got that for my money looks so good right there let's put some money in it really quick so great I did purchase this contact paper from Amazon. I did resurface my table just so it can be brighter in here because my room is super dark and yeah. So in the future, there's gonna be a lot of new envelope making videos. I'm gonna have to cut this, hold on. I don't know the exact name of the envelope, but it's the envelope that has the wording on a strip. The money goes in between like so, right? And then pretend this is a cardstock and this is what the envelope looks like. I did find these at, on Amazon as well. And it has 34 pieces. I just want to show the words. Vision. Vacation. Water. Farm. Electric. Saving. Shopping. Emergencies. Insurance. Clothing. Coffee. Christmas. Gifts. Gym. Dental. Deposit. Debt. Fate. Find out. Personal. Pet care. Rent. Makeup. Miscellaneous. Health. Bills. Bills. Deposit. Budget. Gas. Ooh, they have a strong odor on them. Very strong odor. Oh, I do not like that smell. Ooh. <clears throat> but that is that. And I did get the cardstock for these. This is the black 12 by 12 smooth cardstock. The paper just looks like regular black paper. Looks nice. I did purchase this Max Dunn dual mode hot and cold laminator. I got a laminator, guys. I can't believe it has come to this day and I bought a laminator. I really thought laminators were super expensive because I have gone to the craft stores in my town and they were up there. But I was able to purchase this laminator for under $40. Like I said earlier, guys, wait a minute. This is not a review on any of the products because this is the very first time I'm seeing these products and unboxing them with you guys. So in the future, if I want to make a review on any of this, these products, I will and I will post it on this channel. Or if you leave me a message, I'll let you know once I have used these products. So we're going to open our laminator. I am super pumped right now. So the first thing I am seeing right out the box, it is this white hole puncher. The next thing I see, ooh, are some laminating sheets. Let me move this out the way. I'm gonna take them out and show you. There are a few different sizes here. These are the smaller sheets. Medium sheets. And the large sheets.
I'm gonna put the laminator sheets in my black envelope that I got from Dollar Tree. All right, I just wanna make sure I put them away so they don't get ruined right in there. I did try to take this off, but it just won't, it's like ripping. Okay, well, we'll figure that out when it comes time. So that's where I'm putting the laminator sheets. Right there. This is the next little pouch that I took out of the box. The first thing I see are these little clear clips. Ooh, I like that. I'm gonna put them there for now. Came with these three rings. Some yarn. And, ooh, these are like little envelopes. It's see-through, but I can put, I can laminate them. Oh, yes. This is super adorable. So it came with one, two, three, four browns. Probably four for all of them. One, two, three whites. Okay. And three blacks. I like that. And last but not least, the main attraction. <laughs> Ooh, I'm at loving the aesthetics. This is the, the corner rounder. And it has its own little spot. That's so cute. How does it go? Ooh, yes. And it comes with a paper cutter already. That is super cool. I love that. That is it for the portion of the haul. Here is my coins. I'm going to separate my coins in this tray for now. And then... Okay, so I separated all of the coins. Here are my quarters, dimes, nickels, and pennies. I think the first one I want to do is the quarters. I feel like it's gonna be the easiest one, so let's do that first. That is it for the quarters. Now we're gonna work on the dimes.
All right, that is it for the dimes. Now let's do the nickels. Let's do the nickels, like I said. And almost done with the nickels. Okay, we're done with the nickels. Now let's do the pennies. My hands are so dirty, they feel so disgusting. Ugh. Okay, that is it for the coin stuffing part of this video. If you love videos like this and you are not yet subscribed to my channel, go on ahead and hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell because it will remind you every time I post a new video. And also, when you subscribe, it is absolutely 100% free to do so. All right, guys. Thank you so much for staying this long and being part of my journey. I just wanted to say thank you so much for my new 100 subscribers. Yes, we did. We, we hit 100 subscribers this week. I'm so grateful and thankful. I know it's only 100 of you. That happened super quickly and I am in awe. Like I said, I want to thank you guys again. Thank you so very much. When we get to about 1,000 subscribers, I will do a little giveaway for somebody. So I will see you on my next one. Bye.